Florida, a name that instantly brings to mind endless sunshine, swaying palm trees, and a coastline that stretches for hundreds of miles. The state is synonymous with sun-drenched beaches and sparkling turquoise waters, a place where the ocean is not just a backdrop but a way of life. Here, the sea shapes the culture, the economy, and the very identity of Florida. Every year millions of visitors flock to these shores drawn by the promise of paradise. Tourism thrives, local businesses boom and communities flourish, all thanks to the ocean's enduring allure. But beneath this idyllic surface, a new and unexpected threat is emerging, one that could upend everything Floridians hold dear. This danger doesn't come in the form of hurricanes or oil spills, disasters that Florida has weathered before. Instead, it lurks deep below the waves, hidden from sight and largely unknown. Recently, marine scientists have uncovered massive unstable sinkholes on the ocean floor, enormous voids that threaten to reshape the coastline and the lives of those who depend on it. Unlike the sinkholes that occasionally swallow cars and homes on land, these oceanic chasms are vast, unpredictable, and potentially catastrophic. News of these discoveries has sent shockwaves through coastal communities. Residents, business owners, and local officials are all grappling with the implications. Florida's very foundation, its limestone bedrock which forms both the land and the seafloor, is proving to be alarmingly fragile, especially offshore. The beautiful turquoise waters that once symbolized safety and abundance now conceal a terrifying secret, lurking just out of sight. As scientists race to understand the scope of the problem, the state faces a crisis that could redefine its future and its relationship with the ocean forever. What happens when the very ground beneath the sea gives way? It's a question that haunts not only scientists but also fishermen, business owners and families who have called Florida home for generations. The potential consequences are staggering, threatening commerce, endangering coastal security, and putting Florida's fragile marine ecosystems at even greater risk. Now, Florida stands on the edge of a new, unsettling reality, one where the future of its coastline, its communities, and its way of life hangs in the balance. To truly grasp the threat posed by oceanic sinkholes, we first need to understand what they are and how they form beneath the waves. On land, Floridians are all too familiar with sinkholes, those sudden gaping collapses that can swallow roads, homes, and entire sections of neighborhoods. These dramatic events are caused by water slowly eroding the limestone bedrock beneath the surface, creating hidden voids that eventually give way. Now imagine this same process unfolding silently on the ocean floor, out of sight and far more difficult to detect. Marine geologists have discovered colossal steep-walled depressions beneath the sea, massive sinkholes that lurk as hidden traps waiting beneath the waves for centuries. Over thousands of years acidic seawater has relentlessly carved out immense chambers and winding cave systems within the Florida platform, creating a fragile network of voids and tunnels. When the delicate balance of pressure and support above these vast empty spaces is disturbed, by natural shifts, storms, or even human activity, the seabed can collapse in an instant, unleashing violent underwater landslides. The danger is severe and immediate. A ship or submarine passing above could be pulled down by the sudden powerful suction created by the collapse, with little chance to escape. The resulting turbulence can also wreak havoc on critical underwater infrastructure, snapping cables and rupturing pipelines that supply energy and communications. Even more alarming, these collapses can release toxic gases trapped below, creating deadly low oxygen zones that suffocate marine life and disrupt entire ecosystems. What makes these oceanic sinkholes truly terrifying is their unpredictability. There is often no warning, just a sudden catastrophic collapse that can change the seafloor in moments. Once familiar shipping lanes and productive fishing grounds have now become potential minefields, where disaster could strike without notice. In response, scientists are racing against time to map these hidden dangers, using sonar, underwater drones, and advanced computer models to search for warning signs before the next collapse occurs. The threat remains silent, invisible, and urgent, lurking just beneath the calm surface, waiting to reveal itself when we least expect it. The story began with a curiosity, not a catastrophe, it started quietly with questions whispered among those who spent their lives on and beneath the waves. There was no disaster, no urgent call, just a sense that something extraordinary lay hidden, waiting to be found. Fishermen and divers spoke of a peculiar spot offshore, the Green Banana. 
tales of odd currents, strange colors, and mysterious marine life circulated among the local community, sparking intrigue and speculation. Located 155 feet below the surface, it was known for its strange water chemistry and unusual marine life. The water there seemed different, denser, richer, and teeming with creatures rarely seen elsewhere. Scientists suspected it was a blue hole, an underwater sinkhole open to the surface. These rare formations are portals to hidden worlds, often shrouded in mystery and scientific wonder. In 2019, researchers explored it, finding nutrient-rich water fed by groundwater from the Florida aquifer. Their instruments revealed a complex web of chemical interactions, hinting at connections deep within the Earth. Inside, they discovered unique microbial mats, living carpets of bacteria and archaea thriving where sunlight barely reached, and species thriving in isolation. Some of these organisms had adapted to the sinkhole's extreme conditions, evolving in ways never before documented. The green banana was a self-contained ecosystem, a biological island on the sea floor, cut off from the outside world yet bursting with life. But it was just the beginning, hinting at a much larger phenomenon. The discovery raised new questions. How many more blue holes lay hidden? What secrets did they hold? If one such feature existed, there could be many more, larger, more unstable, and hidden beneath the waves, waiting to be explored. The Green Banana's mystery launched a broader investigation. Scientists from across the country joined forces, eager to unlock the secrets of Florida's underwater world. Local knowledge and scientific inquiry had uncovered a secret world beneath Florida's waves, blending tradition and technology in the search for answers. The discovery was about to change everything we thought we knew about the state's underwater landscape, opening a new chapter in the exploration of Earth's final frontiers. Armed with clues from the green banana, scientists launched a full-scale investigation in 2025. Their mission mapped the seafloor and find more anomalies. Using a research vessel equipped with multi-beam sonar, they created detailed 3D maps of the seabed. The results were alarming, a landscape riddled with depressions and massive holes, far larger than the green banana. Dozens of previously unknown oceanic sinkholes were found. Autonomous underwater vehicles dove into the darkness, mapping sheer walls and analyzing water chemistry. Some sinkholes were hundreds of feet across with unstable fractured edges. Dangerous levels of hydrogen sulfide gas seeped from fissures. Seismic profiling revealed vast unsupported caverns beneath the mapped sinkholes. The ocean floor was terrifyingly thin, like an eggshell waiting to crack. The discovery was not a triumph, but a dawning horror. A clear and present danger had been uncovered on a scale no one imagined. The gravity of the findings was undeniable. The research team sent an urgent report to the Coast Guard and FEMA detailing the unstable sinkholes in major shipping lanes and fishing grounds. The federal response was swift. An emergency task force was convened and the Coast Guard issued a captain of the port order. Vast sections of Florida's coastal waters were shut down to all vessel traffic. Coast Guard cutters patrolled exclusion zones turning away ships and boats. Notices to mariners and flight restrictions were issued. For the first time, Florida's coastline was locked down, not for a hurricane, but for a threat beneath the sea. The shutdown sent shockwaves through the state, underscoring the seriousness of the crisis. The shutdown's impact was immediate and severe. For thousands, the ocean is their livelihood and identity. The closure severed that connection overnight. Commercial fishing families lost their primary income, boats sat idle and seafood markets dried up, Tourism suffered as charter captains and dive shops canceled bookings. News of the Florida shutdown scared away visitors, shattering the state's image as a safe paradise. Coastal communities were gripped by frustration and fear. Town hall meetings turned tense as residents demanded answers. The invisible enemy, geological instability, bred anxiety and uncertainty. Families worried about mortgages, businesses faced bankruptcy, and entire towns feared collapse. The shutdown wasn't just economic it was a loss of tradition and purpose. The sea, once a partner, had become a source of fear. Floridians wondered if their way of life would ever return. While headlines focused on people, marine biologists warned of a quieter crisis. Oceanic sinkholes threatened Florida's diverse and fragile marine ecosystems, coral reefs, seagrass beds, and more. A sudden collapse is catastrophic, instantly burying habitats and killing countless organisms. Toxic plumes of hydrogen sulfide create dead zones, suffocating marine life. 
slow-moving creatures like corals and sponges are especially vulnerable. A single event could wipe out centuries-old reefs. The destruction of spawning and nursery grounds could devastate fish populations for decades. The shutdown also prevented scientists from monitoring and mitigating damage. The ocean's health is tied to the geology beneath it, now proving unstable. The silent victims are the thousands of species facing a sudden, deadly threat. The discovery of oceanic sinkholes shattered our sense of security, but also served as a wake-up call. We must respond with science, not panic. Funding research and mapping every inch of the Florida platform is now essential. Knowledge will help us create safer shipping lanes and manage ocean resources wisely. Investing in monitoring systems could provide life-saving warnings before a collapse. This crisis reminds us we must listen to the planet. The ocean is not a limitless resource, it's complex and fragile. Our survival depends on heeding these warnings and adapting. The future of Florida will be shaped by how we respond, through science, respect and resilience. The depths have revealed our vulnerability but also an opportunity to build a safer, more informed future.